guys, what's up? Welcome to my channel, I'm Brianna, and if you clicked on this video to learn how to pack your personal bag on the plane and not have to do a check bag or a carry-on bag, pack everything you need effective and efficiently, then keep on watching. So guys, in order for you to pack smart and efficiently, then you need to prepare ahead of time. Do not try to pack the day before or, well honestly, I'm, I kind of packed the day of, but don't try to pack too soon before the flight because you will leave something or miss something, especially when you're trying to downsize things and condense everything. So right now, I'm actually preparing for my flight. I have a night flight, so I'm just gonna show you guys how I pack how I prepare so that I can have as less as possible, but also everything that I need. So I'm starting off with these products from Mary. These are very minimalist um, makeup, everyday makeup, something that you can just throw on and you look incredibly natural, but it definitely covers, um, you know, blemishes or anything that you want to cover. So we're starting with this because when you're going through the airport, you never know who you may see. Honey, I am on the market, I am single, so you never know, my husband may be at the airport. So we just need to clean up, cover a bit of these blemishes just so I can be as confident as possible. And this is not something that I wanna be carrying around in the airport. The only makeup that I wanna bring with me is the makeup that I'm gonna be bringing or wearing every day. Um, this is more of, like I said, a minimal look but it's perfect for on the go, everyday things. That way you're not going into your full size products that you're using for everyday application. So I'm just using this uh, foundation stick by Merit and it is in the color sepia, I believe that's the color. And guys, it was super easy for me to match my color because they have such great diagrams so this color matches perfectly with my skin um absolutely love how smooth it goes on and it also has this brush and i'm just kind of buffing this in making sure i'm getting it evenly distributed so next guys i'm going in with a little bit of blush i have the blush in cheek color mood and it's just this really dark deep color i love it because it's super natural but it still kind of gives you the color into your face i am loving me some blush lately i'm absolutely loving to wear blush so I love that this is a part of my minimal makeup look because I can still have rosy cheeks, but natural rosy cheeks. So of course when I'm doing a full face, I will go in with concealer under my brows, but we're not doing that today. Merit has a brow stick that you can just kind of glide your brows like this. So next I'm going in with my Merit mascara. As you guys can see, the bristles the bristles on this brush is super big. It looks really good and it just gives you this natural eyelash effect. And you don't have to build and build and build because immediately it really plumps your eyelashes. So last but not least, I'm gonna go in with my lip tint. So I have um, All Natural and I also have Pink Beat. So I think I'm gonna go in with All Natural which is like an orange tint. And guys, I love this. This goes on, it kind of reminds me of chapstick, but it has like a color, a tint color to it. And it just kind of gives your lips some moisture and some color. So this is all I'm doing for the airport, guys. Like I said, super natural, super simple. Doesn't even look like I have any makeup on, but that is the point. Really fresh, natural makeup to go to the airport. So let's go ahead and pack. Okay guys, so we're gonna fit everything that I have here in this bag. I got this bag from American Black Film Festival a couple years ago and it's just perfect and it's considered a personal item. So basically, just to keep this um, short and sweet, I have separated my clothes by, I have a purse, my top, my bottom, my panties, and any underwear or undergarments that I need for this outfit in one bag. So I've learned, I, I fly with this personal item once a month, at least once a month, and I've learned that having everything separated 
helps so so much so I had a huge haul um, with Shein clothes and I used these little baggies to um, separate it and I've actually seen people use like Ziploc, Ziploc bags to separate as well so I was so happy when I got a lot of these bags because I knew that I would need them for this trip so if you are going through TSA and you need to grab your ID or if you need to throw your ID in your bag at least everything is in bags in its own separate bags so it won't be hard to find it if you need to find it now if all these clothes were just thrown in the bag it may in be in between the shirt it may be in between some pants so I love having this and the more organized that you are the better so these are my outfits I have four bags with clothes one two three four so I have my makeup bag and I did condense this so my big makeup bag is in my vanity back there but this is my travel makeup bag and this is my accessories in this small bag and then these are just some flip-flops just in case and then I also have some socks because when I'm in a hotel I like to have socks to walk around and stuff like that and sometimes or most of the time my feet are cold so I also have another little baggie for my scarf and my bonnet so as a black girl we wear bonnets and scarves to bed to preserve our hair but our natural oils get into the scarf and the bonnet and it can transfer onto other clothes and that's another reason why it's great to have separate baggies so nothing gets on anything and this is water resistant so even if something spills it's not gonna get on anything thank God and um, if any oils do you know saturate into this bonnet and this scarf I won't transfer that onto any of my white clothes or anything that I have so I did just wash my bonnet and my um, my bonnet and my scarf so I put it in this baggie and we're good to go this little bag is for my toiletries I have everything from toothpaste toothbrush deodorant um, just everything is in this little baggie I have this bag here guys and this is just what the bag looks like so I'm gonna take advantage of all the pockets in this bag so basically I have put my wet wipes to wipe off the seat on the plane I put them in this pocket so it's easy accessible so anything that you want to easily access make sure you put it in the outer pockets of whichever bag that you are flying with so I also have my wallet my mask my IDs everything in here my lip gloss um, I'll have my charger here and my phone will be in here in this other pocket so this is how the bag looks I will be wearing some tennis shoes but I'm gonna be wearing those on my flight and I will show you guys my OOTD or outfit of the night because we're flying at night but I'm gonna show you that later so I'm wearing my tennis shoes to the airport so I have two or three other pair of shoes one is the flip-flops that is in this bag and then I have I have these and I have these heels so basically what I'm gonna do is start packing the shoes first at the bottom of the bag so you kind of want to stack them like this and we're just going to place them in the bag at the bottom again stacking them like this to save room I'm gonna put my socks and my flip-flops down at the bottom as well make sure you are pressing the bags guys so that the air can come out so I'm gonna throw this in there like that and then I'm just gonna take all four outfits Put them in the bag side by side like so. So boom. So I'm going to stick my makeup bag here on the side. And you want to use every space you have, guys. I'm going to stick this bag down in the side of the bag. And this toiletry bag is going to go right on top like so my scarf is gonna go right here so I'm just gonna stick my computer 
right here on the side so it'll be easy for me to take it out when I'm going through TSA. So I'm probably just gonna throw like a comb and different little whatnots in here. But for the most part, we are packed and ready to go.